Welcome. In this video, I'll show you how to send email in Brevo. All right. So first up, just go ahead and go to app.brevo.com. All right. So once you're in here, first up, you would need to set up your contact. All right. So how do we do that? So first up, go ahead over to the left panel and click on contacts. And here you can go ahead and add in some more contacts by clicking on create a contact. Okay. Add a first name, last name, email, SMS number, if necessary. If you're only sending emails, just leave it blank and hit on create. And if you have a CSV file for your contacts, you can go ahead and import your contacts from here. Just click on import contacts right here, hit on continue and import from file or copy and paste. Okay. Now going back in here, just go ahead over to campaigns. Now go ahead and click on create a campaign. And here we would select email. All right. And for this example, we're going to be using regular as A or B right here is just a test. And it says here, the version with the best engagement will be sent to your remaining recipients. So let's not do that just for now. Okay. Campaign name right here, maybe offers like so. Head on create campaign. In here, we have the sender. As you can see here, I have my email address. So it would be better if you set up your domain or business email. All right. You can go ahead and click on manage a sender right here. Now click on a drop down and you can go ahead and click on add a new sender. All right. Go ahead and use your business email so it will look professional. Okay. If not, just click on X. Recipients right here, add recipient. And here click on the drop down and select the list. Okay. For example, your first folder right here, just click on it. And here we have your first list, number two, which has two contacts as I've shown you earlier. Okay. Once it's selected, Go ahead and click on advanced options and go ahead and add in some condition. If not, just leave it as is. Okay. Hit on save. Now go to subject, add a subject right here. For example, good day. Then go ahead and add in some variable. For example, the first name. All right. Wait for it and then click on contact variable or attribute. And here select um, first name like so. All right. And it will look like this. Here's the preview. Okay. Company name, good day, first name, and then add in a preview text, for example. Read this email, just like that, okay? It will look like this. Hit on save. Now go ahead and click on design, start designing. Right here, you can go ahead and use templates right here, and we have the template gallery right here, okay? Say, for example, this one, um, special offer. Okay, I'm going to use the template. If you want to preview it, you, you have the button to preview it. Okay, close this one. Now, now you can go ahead and edit this one. Just double click if you wanted to edit some text, like so. All right, change other buttons right here. We have background color, spacing, style right here. If you want to replace it, go ahead and do so by just clicking on the replace button. You can go ahead and upload an image right here. For example, this one, open, wait for it to upload, hit on insert, like so. As you can see, that is up to you how you uh, edit this one, All right? So once that's done, just hit on save and quit, like so. Wait for it to load. In here, scroll all the way down. If you want to add in some additional settings, click on edit settings. Right here, we have personal life. The sent to field, sending and tracking, subscription, and design. Okay. After that, go ahead and uh, click on schedule. Or if you want to, you can go ahead and preview and test. Okay. Schedule. Send now or schedule for later. Or set at best time. Send now, for example. And after that, just wait for it and you're good to go. And you just sent an email using Bravo. Well, I hope this video helps and I'll see you in the next one.